Welcome to Emedco TV's instructional video on how to properly install a steel U-channel signpost. Here's what you'll need to properly install your signpost. One steel U-channel post, of course, a post driver, some white spray paint, a marker, measuring tape, and a level. Choosing your signpost. Choose the signpost and size that best fits your needs. Today we will be using the popular steel U-channel signpost. Posts come in several heights, 4, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and 12 foot. Today we are using a standard 8 foot U-channel post. Now it's time to install your post. The first thing you'll need to do is find the best location. It is important to know how far down into the ground you will need to sink your post. If you don't drive it down far enough, the post will loosen and begin to fall over. A four foot post should be driven one and a half to two feet deep. Six and seven foot posts should be driven two and a half feet deep, and posts from eight to 12 feet tall should be driven three and a half feet deep. Look at the graph to see how much of your post will actually be above ground. Today we are using an eight foot post, so we will need to drive it three and a half feet into the ground. This will give us a four and a half foot tall post. If you're installing an eight foot post like this one, a good way to determine how far down to drive your post is to measure up three and a half feet from the bottom of the post and mark it with a marker. Okay. Now it's time to mark the spot where you wish to drive your post. Look around for the best location and mark it with spray paint. Have your assistant bring you the post driver and hand them the post. Then slip the open end of the post driver over the post while it is at an angle. Then slowly walk it to an upright position. Here is something you need to keep in mind. You should be able to drive your post without a step ladder for four, six, seven, and eight foot posts. You will probably need a step ladder for nine foot posts and taller. Be sure that your step ladder is on level ground before installation. Now you are ready to drive your post. Simply push the driver up in the air and lightly pull down allowing gravity to drive the post. Do this a few times until the post is a few inches deep. Now it's time to check if the post is level. Be sure to check both sides. You will know that the post is level if the air bubble sits between the two lines. Now that your post is level, it's time to drive the post the remaining three and a half feet into the ground. We at Amedco TV hope this video on how to install a sign post was helpful. Now that you have your post in the ground, you will probably need to mount a sign to it. See our next instructional video on how to properly mount a sign to a post.